Hello everyone, I am Marcelema and welcome to Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trials and Tribulations. You didn't expect this, right? <laughs> you didn't expect this, right? It's not even been 20 seconds yet. This is already going great. Okay, um, if you haven't ever seen or even played or even seen a single Phoenix Fight game, you do not know what you're missing out on. This game is exciting as all hell. And I've been excited to play this game for a long time now. This is one of those games that if you start playing it, you can't stop until you're finished with it. I haven't actually played the first of the trilogy, but I saw YouTube people play this. This is the second game in the series. I haven't played this game, but still, so yeah, it's going to be blind. And one more thing before we start. Since this game is 99% reading, I'm not going to be reading anything. Instead, I'm just going to release my thoughts and opinions and ideas and reactions in this game as I go. So just prepare yourself for reading. But alright, let's put your plus protection armor on because we're going to play Phoenix Fight Ace Attorney TNT. Let's just start before we lose it. Alright. Case number one, turn about memories. Someone's tired. What? Another accidental murder, I suppose? Love problems, I suppose. Something about... I need to know about that girl. What exactly? So... Okay. Yeah, I bet it wasn't you. Of course it wasn't. <laughs> Mia failed second trial. Huh. Okay then. Your third trial or something like that? Oh, it's you. Gross. Grossberg. Wasn't it something Grossberg? I know that line. Are you actually Grossberg? Oh, you are. I thought it was something else for some reason. First time in the big league, so that's why. I, th I thought this was your first trial. Oh, second time in court. Okay. Oh, something to do with you? You think? <laughs> oh, that's you. Hi there. You were the one who... Well, never mind. Yeah, good morning to you too. <laughs> Wait, Phoenix? Is... That's Phoenix? That you, Phoenix? Okay then.
Yeah, I can see that you have a code. So... Maybe you didn't do it. If we're here to get you to be innocent, then... Well, as they say in court, you can only believe. You're still pretty new at this lawyer thing. So this is five years earlier, which means... Five years from now, Phoenix will... Hmm. Maybe that's spoilers, I shouldn't say that. First time you appeared in court was a year ago. So is this your second big match? Big match? Or... Was it just a year difference? We, we, a year gap between the two sessions. Maybe it was a year gap. Maybe the, or maybe this was just a big match. I love how the guy has a pink sweater with a heart on it, nonetheless. <laughs> oh man. For the trial of Phoenix Wright. Uh huh. Out of all the things I expected, the, out of all the things I expected, this was not what I expected. Oh, the prosecutor. I bet you were pretty good once too, weren't you? Well, Marvin is right there too, isn't he? Right next to you. I think I saw him. Emergency. Yeah, that's what I thought. He was right next to you. Hey, don't call me a rookie. You don't know who I am. You don't know my story. Psst. Wow. Such words. You were not like that the last time I saw you. Maybe you really were a lot more confident back then. Yeah, probably. He called you a little girl. The music is the music is also different. Dog swallow. Pharmacology. Pharmacology, huh? I wonder what that is. Hmm. There seems to be a wire that is cut open. And there's an umbrella there. These are evidences that may or may not be very important soon enough. Suspicious indeed, huh? Well then, uh, yeah, you're as terrible as always, Mr. Judge. <laughs> Let's take a, take a look at court record for a moment. Attorney badge. Proof of my profession. There's the last time I used. Oh, so this was. Okay. Date and time of death: 4:09 at 3 p.m. 3 p.m. Okay. Fatal electric shock. Well, of course it wasn't him then. Behind the EVU building. Check bottom for details. Right. So there, there was an electric thing right over there. That's definitely important, I can't tell that much. 
a cause of death, electrical shock. I have already gotten information about this. Well, I don't know who, about how unusual this is, but I guess it is. People don't usually die to electric shocks. I mean, how much, how often does that happen? You are a, you are a Jintu man. Gen, Jintu man. Okay. What? You are trying to make uh, yourself to be like a steel man or something like that? Uh, we did. Uh, um, the details of the case are there. Yeah, I took a look at that already. Yeah, I did. Profiles. There's profiles too. Grossberg, Superior, yep. The new client. Third year art student at Eevee University, currently has a cold. Victim, fourth year, yep. Who are you? Phoenix Wright's girlfriend. She had a girlfriend? She did a victim dose follow up until eight months ago. Prosecutor of this trial. A little too much confidence. Yeah, I realized that. I already touched the core like a button. Cause of death. And... Now uh, this thing. Fatal electric shock. Yep. Or you can just take a look at the picture, you know? It really clearly says that or shows that there is yeah motive yeah yeah for some reason I thought that I thought that it was weird that Phoenix fight had a girlfriend so apparently they had a fight because I guess in the end, Phoenix let the girlfriend go because he was, well, the other guy died and Phoenix was, uh, suspicious for murder, I'm guessing. Yeah, I don't like it either. Smooth operator. He's a lot smoother than he was before, that's for sure. Last time he was wearing like... You know... Rookie killer. <laughs> yeah, you're a rookie killer. I'm not a rookie though. <laughs> I'm a... Rookie killer killer. <laughs> Evidence, yeah. We got evidence. <laughs> Old Greybeard's face. <laughs> yep, I did that. What was the cause of death? Or motive? was this. Dahila... Dahila... Half Throne. That's not... an unusual name.
Well, we'll make sure that the judge rethinks his thinking this. All right. So Phoenix Fight is coming to the witness stand to say what he thinks. And well, if you you were never mind. Yeah, you were a lot of tattoos and cause and tattoos. Yeah, I feel right. Don't pass the code to other people. That's rude. <laughs> Alright. The third testimony. The victim and I. What you gotta say? You were there? Okay. You found his body. Suck up British wannabe, huh? Um, for some reason I think you m hmm. You may have been at that place. I think Phoenix Fight is just a little bit too shy to admit he was there, but he was not the one who did it. <laughs> what are you laughing about? Cross-examination. Yeah, I know that. Apparently, well... Well, I know that. Some people may not. Contradictions. Yeah, we are looking for the truth. Well, if there was a lie, it was probably a minor one. Even if there is a lie, it's probably just a minor lie. Okay, so... I... I admit I was there. You're not a killer, you only found his body, you hardly knew him to begin with, you never even talked to him. I can handle it. <laughs> yeah, we'll be fine, we can do it. Yep. Let's start pressing then. You were there, okay. <laughs> or something happened. Something. <laughs> oh, come on. You just bumped into each other. You're not a killer. All I did was find his body. Let's make sure to make sure that you are not a killer. Or if you found the body, you know. Whichever one comes. <laughs> yeah. Some other student. Or students. 
Witness. Uh, could you stop that? 